picked Austin. Okay, cool. That's fine. <laughs> Austin's better than me anyway. Let's, uh... Let's keep going, shall we? Let us continue with Hotline Miami 2. We're gonna pick up right where we left off on Tuesday night. If you're watching uh, live with us here, of course. There's also the folks checking out the VOD over on the YouTube channel. YouTube.com slash BearTaffy if you want to check that out. Thank you all, Morag Raiders. You guys are fantastic. Hi, I'm Bear Taffy, part of Main Menu, as you probably are aware. As Morag, I'm sure, let you know. We are uh, playing some Hotline Miami 2. It's a good time. You can catch me here uh, every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, and sometimes days in between. And I am just going to get right back into this. The 16th scene, Casualties. And we're not going to skip the intro. i gotta, I got to kind of remind myself what's going on here. 12 months and Twitch doesn't even notify us. God damn it. Praylight, thank you, buddy, very much for the support. That is amazing. Thank you, thank you. Oh, we get to watch this again. Yeah, I remember this now. This is tomorrow's the last mission, huh? Yeah, if they can't find another bullshit reason to get us killed. For once, I agree with you, Barge. Why are you always picking on me? We're in this shit together, right? As for tomorrow, I don't get it. I really don't. How the hell are the four of us going to capture a power plant, huh? They should be sending in a whole platoon. The place is likely booby trap. Too risky for a whole platoon. I guess we're more... Expendables 3! Coming to theaters March 17th. Ah, yes. Do you see this? Can you see my face? This is my true nature. You see, don't you? This is who I am. This is who we all are. We're animals. There's no denying it. A bunch of goddamn animals. Selling us out to slaughter a beast slaughtered. And there we sit until they tell us what to do and how to do it. <laughs> God, excuse me. <coughs> No will of our own. I'm not going to do that voice anymore. Just mindless obedience. We don't even know why we're fighting now, do we? All we know is that deep down somewhere in there we enjoy it. Destruction and violence is just part of our nature. So are you okay? And then he takes off the squid. I may have had a bit too much to drink. I'm feeling a little bit tired. Maybe I better go to bed. Might be a good idea, sir. What kind of fucked up shit he's been drinking? The community has been saying this is the most difficult level in the game. Ooh. Well, that's... That's mildly intimidating. Do we go with a sniper rifle then? Just to bump up the difficulty even further. That seems like a terrible idea, which is probably why I'm gonna do it. Ask him what cookie shorts are. I... Well, now I wanna know, actually. Jeez. Mmm. Sniper rifle's good, yeah? Hmm. Lieutenant? Yes, sir? I don't feel very good today. He's blinking with one eye at a time, so that was a good indicator. That's got nothing to do with it, unfortunately. I've got word that they're sending you boys home tomorrow. Lord knows whether they're lying or not, but that's not the issue. I'm afraid this might be your last mission, son. And that they'll be sending you home in body bags. You've seen the plan, so you should know. You'll be walking right into a trap, and there's little I can do about it. I've already said this to the others, and I'll say it to you, too. It's been damn good commanding this squad, Lieutenant. We may not win this war, but I couldn't be more proud of you, boys. Thank you, sir. Well, look out there, you'll need it. Ellipsis. It's always refreshing to know that he ends the conversation with hesitation. It's so much like poop. That's really what we're going for, is to try to brand ourselves as a pile of poop. That's what I'm hoping everyone can see when they come to this channel. <laughs> okay, let's see. I say we go for it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Morag, thank you for the host as well, man. Beautiful man, you. Well, the soldiers may be the... Hotline Miami 1 protagonist. I almost said Half-Life 1 due to that acronym. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Um, tell you what. No. Ooh, I have a sniper. I forgot. Okay, we gotta be mindful of that. So they're gonna... Where'd that line come from? There they are. 
Do I go for this? No, that's a terrible plan. Okay. I'm starting to think the sniper rifle was a really bad decision. That seems to be the case. Fortunately, yep. Mm, boy, yeah, I'm probably gonna wanna... Oh, no. Oh, no. Backpap! How's it going, buddy? Alright, we're gonna let these guys go by. Probably try to walk over here or something. Or we could just switch to the knife. I wonder if I could tell you what, actually. We're gonna try something totally ridiculous. Let's see if I can just go for a, uh, a clean sweep here with this first lineup. Try this out. Alright. Oh, yeah, there we go. That does the job. Alright. I am down with that. I might need to actually, hold on, we're gonna bump down the sound effects just a touch. I noticed that was a little on the loud side. Alright, I doubt this is gonna work a second time, but we'll try it anyway. See if I can just jump out at him. Oh my god, it actually did it. Well, that's six down. God damn. Now, where would they come out if they saw me? I think I actually might be able to do this too. Let's go for it. He didn't see me there. Can I hit him through the window? I might be able to, actually. Oh, oh damn! Okay, uh, this is, uh... Not the worst plan. Yeah, <laughs> no bodies here. Nope. Don't don't worry about this. Splattering a what in the hell is this guy doing here? Well, one less guy to worry about. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, just please no back seating in general. I would definitely appreciate that. I will ask for hints and help if I need it, to be sure. Shredding these fools, man. The knife does work. There's no denying it. So we can take out the sniper and try to deal with this guy this way. Oh, well, that didn't work. Okay. I uh, still think we're okay, though. I'm gonna take off that lock on. Ooh, if it's just this guy. There we go. Alright, alright, alright. This is... This is okay. You can stab through the windows. Alright, I should keep that in mind, then. This guy is gonna sneak up on me. I know it. Where did he go? Is there anyone up here? Yep, there is. Oh, jeez, it's a big dude. Oh, and they're coming around now, too. Okay. We're still fine, though. We're still totally okay. This is... <laughs> they're starting to catch wind of what's going on over here. This is... This is odd. They don't normally deliver the pile of bleeding bodies until next week. Hmm. So there is a big guy. Big old fella. There might be... Actually, I think that's a wall they can't see through. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Okay, so we're good there. Let's see. Oh, making it easy for me, aren't you? Or maybe not. We can get him, though, I bet. Let's see if I can get this lock on real fast. What are you doing over there? That is not where you should be. Are they both melee? They are both melee. Tell you what. Let's just... Try to lure them over. Come here, buddy. Come on, now. Okay, okay. Nice. Not bad. There's just one guy over here. Oh, there's a few dudes with guns. Okay, tell you what. So let's try... Oh, goodness. That was scary. Okay. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Keep moving, keep moving. Got it? Good? Alright, not bad, not bad. Uh, yeah, my playthrough of the first one is up on my YouTube channel. It absolutely is. You can definitely check it out there. I can totally hit this shot. Yes, sir. Oh my goodness. This is very effective, actually. Wow. I like that. Okay, area clear. God damn. There's another guy. Can probably make this work. Let's see if I can get an angle here somewhere. I doubt it. Unless... Boom, baby! Okay! Might be just these last two over here now. Dead Defender, what's up, buddy? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Alright. If I hang out over this way, I'm just gonna check everywhere. And I think we're all clear. I think it's just these last two. I can go like that. There we go. Makes no fucking idea. <laughs> Ooh, I like the sniper call here now. Boo ya kasha. That worked out. All right, let's move forward. I'll take a sip here. Take a victory sip real fast. And we're not getting style points for this, but we're making progress, and that's that's more important, maybe. Yeah, let's go take cover real fast. Oh, early kill. Oh, I'm dead. Yep, all right. 
So this is still an okay st Oh god, that was totally unintentional, but that'll work. Hmm. Oh, that's not gonna do. Where can I hang out over here? I might be able to do this. If I can just play Ring Around the Rosie with them for a second, though, damn it. Oh, God. Oh, horse gin. I'm glad to hear it, buddy. That's what I aim to do. Ball tingling is a specialty of mine. Whether it be by audio instigation or otherwise. Yeah, that? Okay, so they start to swarm in on you a little bit there, which means I'm probably better off getting slit into my throat. Seems like a really good strategy. Okay, here we go. I'm knifing these two motherfuckers. Boom! Oh, yes! That's good. Okay, now. Gotta use a gun on this fella. That'll do. We got a couple more. There's one in the center there, and we have another big guy. Let's get that lock on. I probably am going to get it, actually, Ramses. In fact, I'm kind of excited to turn that into uh, maybe a little bit of a staple on the channel here, to be honest. It's a little bit of insight into the future there, but... I am looking forward to some GTA V action, Ramses. I've watched a lot of other people play it. I got into it a little bit myself in the console release, but never was really a... Uh, uh, it didn't really catch my attention that much, so... I think I am... Uh, gonna try to get a little bit more into it once it comes out for PC. This is dangerous, and I don't think I can go front... I don't think I can go just face-to-face -face here, so perhaps... Hmm... I'm, just, I'm glad to hear it, Ramses, yes. A clan on PC for us. Oh, in uh, GTA 5, right, yeah. Miss Mary Mac! How you doing? Bear Spelunky is super ball tingling. IGN said a lot of stuff about me, that ain't true. Oh, shit. Oh, boy! <laughs> God. I tell you what, let's get this guy over here. I don't know what to do about these two. I guess... We just go like this. So what if we just go right in front of here, go like that, and then we can do the same thing on this side to him. That'll do the job, I guess. Sniper rifle OP is hell right now, man. This is amazing, except when it misses completely, and then I have to... Oh, come on! God damn. I should have been... I should have been looking up there. Ugh. Yeah, the plot to this game is uh, very confusing up in the air. It's really up for interpretation, which is the, uh, the aspect of it that a lot of people tend to become frustrated with. Myself, maybe even a little bit. Oh, damn it. I still like that approach, though. It can be very, very confusing. And what's interesting about it, too, is something I've noticed as I've been watching other people play it a little bit. Is that... Oh, God, what the hell? <laughs> that was bad. Is that, uh... Storytelling in a game like this is kind of difficult to do. I mean, obviously you have the... Availability of... <laughs> He just fucking t casually turned around, shot me point blank in the mouth. That was, that was brutal. So, it's it's difficult to tell the story here because, I mean, obviously you don't get a ton of emotional range from top-down characters, and that's just kind of a uh, a necessary evil when you're choosing to do the game in a style such as this. I kind of wish there was a little bit more exposition involved. Maybe not exposition. Maybe I should say, like, a little bit more, um... A little bit easier of a connection to draw between storylines, I guess. That's really what the biggest problem is, in my opinion, is the fact that it's very difficult to put the pieces together. And again, that's kind of the part of the open-to-your-own-interpretation bit, but at the same time... I don't know, it, just, it, it can get very, very confusing. Very easily. Yeah, it's very ambiguous, exactly. Hmm. You really liked Hotline Miami 1's plot. Hotline Miami 2 has the arcs such as the sun that I didn't really get much from. Yeah, and that's the th other thing, too, is they're kind of getting involved with a whole bunch of different plot lines here. Like, I think there's a lot more to this story than there was for Hotline Miami 1. So, that's just a... Uh, an interesting caveat to it as well. 
Okay, let's try to look up a little bit further this time, make sure I don't get surprised. I don't think I can actually hit that guy from the, where I'm standing, but what I could do... Oh, I can't reach him there. What the hell? I guess that... Oh, that's like a little barricade that's in the way, okay. So, there's another dude up there. I don't know what's going on over that way, so I'm terrified to do that. I hope so, True Heart. Yeah, I'm, lo I'm looking forward to the potential of there being some uh, loose ends tied up with some of these later chapters. I'm prepared for that, for sure. Come here, buddy. There we go. Alright, let's try to dance around over here. This dude's just gonna have to get shot, I guess. Oh, God. <laughs> Love shooting corners of the wall. And then there might just be the last two over here. I think that's what we're looking at. So I guess we just want to go over here real fast. Go bam, and then... Boom! All right. Good stuff. Let's keep going. Hmm. Mostly indoors, it looks like. Yep. Kind of switch it up here. Can probably... Ooh, hey. Here we go. This will make it easy. Come here, buddy. There we are. I don't know uh, about the copyright issues with music. I know Hotline Miami 1 definitely had uh, some music copyright issues. So it's it's dangerous territory to try to monetize the Hotline Miami content. But I think they've addressed the majority of what was going on with that in the past. Let's just try to shoot this guy real fast. Oh shit, I can't go back out. Yeah, okay, that's not a good call. So, we can't really go around the outside. We've not really presented a lot of options here. Hmm. Let's see. <laughs> they, don't, they don't really care too much, Clifford. Yeah, they uh, tend to let piles of corpses go as just normal happenstance. Tell you what, I'm just going to try to... I'm just going to try to get shot in the face real quick, if that's cool with everyone. How in the world? I guess I gotta do some quick shots. We got one ranged over here, another ranged in this room, and the big guy, of course. So this is gonna be really difficult. I don't really see a way to do this. What if I can... Alright, we got another melee. So tell you what, let's do this. That was not what I had planned at all. Nope. God damn it, I keep switching out to the gun when I made that the melee. Oh boy. <laughs> that is... Wow! This is, um... That didn't work. This is not easy at all. I can't even, yeah, I can't even sit there. They can see me from in those rooms. My god. Huh. Some beauties are muted, Miss Mary Mac. Oh, damn. That sucks. That's kind of... That's not very reassuring. Man. I'm just gonna try a quick approach here. If I can... get beyond this portion. See if I can maybe dance around like that. Whoa! Good lord! Okay, actually that kind of works, so let's try that again. We're gonna wait a second over here. Wait until they're not really in the range that we have to deal with. Okay, that does the job. Ah, he's too fast. Okay. Okay, wait for that again. I'm okay with this, actually. I'm okay with this approach. And then... Oh, damn it. I keep forgetting, man. The double glass doors. That is... That is absurd to deal with. Ah, keep... See, it looks like I've got the knife out, but I, I keep misreading the situation. That was helpful. Oh god, I'm dead. Yep, I'm dead. Yeah, if, the, if Big Boy comes out, that I, I'm pretty screwed. If that happens, but... Oh, man. Man, ooh, if I had chosen correctly there, that would have actually worked out okay. Hmm. This level's not looking like it's gonna be... a cakewalk, for sure. Come on over, buddy. You know, if I can just lure them out one by one... It's those range guys on either side, though, that's the big issue. If 
If I can get one at a time, though. No. Man. Visibility for the enemy team is OP right now. I, I know the indications, Violet. I just, I, I keep mistakenly uh, thinking I have one when I have the other. Man! Oh, that was close. Okay, this one. Damn it. I just gotta be able to react very quickly to what the uh, game presents me with. Damn it! Oh, if he didn't have a gun, I might have been able to pull that out. Hmm. Doors versus bear. Alright, here comes the other melee. Good. I just need to be very, very aware. Got him. Shit! I had the wrong freaking weapon out again. Ah! What am I doing? I haven't had this issue before. I swear this has never happened before. Man. Ooh. Yeah, tell me what weapons were available at the start doesn't really help me now, does it, Venture? <laughs> Son of a bitch. I liked having the sniper rifle for a lot of this level, though. Alright, there we go. How? Let's see. Even if I get this guy, they're all gonna be attracted to that sound. I kind of like the idea of sprinting over here because there's a... I don't know, There's, I guess there's maybe enough separation to go this way. Or I could run straight for that corridor, just get shot while dilly-dallying over here. Alright. Let's see. Okay, good. I don't think they have visibility on me. Yeah, I think I'm safe here. Hmm. I want to go in that room, but oh my god, look at this. This is a freaking nightmare. Can I make it in there? I'd really like to. I don't know how much that would help us, though. Ooh, this might be an opportunity. Okay, good. Let's see. Can I just clear this out? If I go in silent... They have tons of visibility from this doorway, though. That's what sucks. Just going out of this room is just gonna be difficult. Although, what I could do, I've got three bullets, I gotta be mindful of that too. Let's try to get a ranged guy, so let's try to get this guy. And then we'll just funnel them all in. It's very difficult to switch the weapon too, you gotta wait for the reload on the sniper. Alright, this is gonna work. I can't even get out of the goddamn doorway. Okay, good. They both have guns, so I gotta be really careful here. Yep. Nice! Alright. This is... Oh, turn off the music bit. Yeah, for sure. Sorry. It it changes itself. Level to level. That's something I gotta continue to adjust to. The music is always changing. Ever a-changing. Alright, I can go all the way around here. I just want to make sure that I didn't forget anybody in this room. I did. Okay, so there's one more melee. Let's see if I can get him to come over this way. I bet I will if he can go a little bit closer. Come here, buddy. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Nice. Alright. Now, I gotta be mindful of the fact that this dude does have eyes down this hallway. So, maybe we ought to go for this, this kill from this position. Probably not game species. Just want to finish up the uh, Hot Lama Miami 2 tonight. Damn it. Ooh, that sucks. Oh, it's really relying on that hitting. Son of a gun. Alright, well, I think the obvious choice is get in position over here and go like that. Wait for this opportunity here. Good. I should have it. Yes! Wow! Holy shit, man. Alright, I need ammo. Where do I get the ammo here? There it is. Got it. Four bullets. That's not ideal. Hopefully we can make it work. My god. 
Is this room clear? This room is not clear, but it looks like it might work out. Alright. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> it's still Hotline Hawaii, yes sir. Good. Ooh, that was dangerous. Holy shit. I'm surprised that worked. <laughs> okay, good. Be able to knock this guy out as well. Mm hmm. Alright, there is visibility from the other room here. I gotta be aware of that. Nice. Alright, down the hall, there's another guy. Come on over here, buddy. Come on over now. Get yourself knocked up. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Oh, God. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad, bad, bad. Shit. Oh, my God. Nearly lost my cool there for a second. Hmm. Ravrak, it's so good, man. I really love it. The OST, the soundtrack for this game, is the freaking moneymaker. It's so, so good. Alright, we're gonna take an opportunity to shoot this guy through the window here. There we go. I can easily get the knife on that. Okay. I think we've cleared this whole area. We got a big guy, so we need at least one bullet for that. It looks like we'll probably have to use... Ooh. This is gonna be really dangerous. So tell you what, here's my plan. I'll bump up the music one more time. Hopefully that'll be good. Uh, let's see. I've got three bullets. I need at least one for him. I think what I do is I uh, target one of these... Yeah, one of these guys. Hopefully we get the vision from down the hallway. This should work. Okay, we got him. Oh, we didn't even... Oh, damn. Okay, well... Depending on his route... Oh, we can easily get him. Okay, I probably actually wasted the bullet there, but whatever. Whatever. Whew. Okay, he definitely does not have visibility, nor does anyone else. Thank you. Alright, four guys left. Big guy with a gun, one range, two melee. Hey, Aze, how's it going, buddy? Alright, this is dangerous. Yeah, yeah, that's... Oh, God, that's a terrible plan. What the shit? How did he chase me that far? God damn. Wow. He's just strafing over my corpse and taunting me. I love the VHS presentation, Rag. Right, right, yeah, I totally agree. It will be main guy. Yep, absolutely. Oh, man. It's been a while, Yeezys. Good to have you back, man. Welcome back to the fold. Alright, I'm gonna try to die real fast. Because I think that's something the enemy won't expect. Is for me to just line myself up to be shot. I do like that start, actually. Then we take this guy out. And then I think I'm gonna go back and get those dudes in the hallway first. <laughs> that was not ideal. Okay. I remember now. I remember what to do. I remember what to do. Uh-huh. Ooh, I didn't realize they had a window there. Oh, shit. That's gonna change things up a little bit. Whoa, where did you come from? Holy cow. What am I doing? I'm getting antsy. I'm getting antsy, that's what I'm doing. Oh, I threw that all away, I really did. But every opportunity to win that time. Okay, I am gonna go for these guys. There's, oh, there's glass all across here. That's what's going on with that. Okay, so I'm going to try to take these two out. <laughs> Saint Joel did your ass. I'm kidding, Venture. Okay, that's fine. That works. I might even want to try to take out Mr. Big first. Now that they've opened the door for me, actually, this is going to be really easy. So yeah, this is a good idea. Let's try to clear this area and then go to the other side. So, we're going to switch out. Lock on. Get this quick snipe, dash out the door. Swipe to the knife. There we go. Okay. All set over here. Now we gotta worry about visibility. Oh, what in the world happened there? Okay. 
That was unexpected. Alright, we're not going in this room yet. Because that is just asking to die. So we're going to try to lure this guy over. Good. I can quickly jump in here and slay him. Son of a bitch, I knew I was going to make that mistake and I still did it anyway. That sucks. Okay, I still like this approach though. Never forget a life day. Hmm. In first person, I don't know, Ramses. In first person, this might get kind of freaking ridiculous. It's kind of my feelings on the situation. Like, think of how quickly we move around. Like, these dudes are showing up out of the goddamn blue most often. Wow, I did that again. That was really convenient. Okay. Ah, he warped through that door. Wall hacks again. Report Mr. Big. I need a full report on Mr. Big on my desk by Monday. That was ridiculous. I have considered playing Transistor. Actually, that is uh, on the near the top of my list for stream games here. What's... I don't know if I want to even call it unfortunate. What's What the situation ends up being is I tend to have more games to stream than I have streaming opportunities. And then the new games come out, and then of course I want to stream those, because I just want to stream the new stuff. Alright, that works. That's what we're looking for. So now we can take down Mr. Big. Without a care in the freaking world. There we go. Alright. Wary of them moving around after that. Yep. Oh god. Fine. As you wish. Oh, they're coming. Oh, they're coming. Whew. Dangerous. Dangerous plays! Oh, <laughs> man. All right, all right, this is good. This is very good. Whoa, that was close. They're all melee. There. Good, good, good. Oh, this is looking much better now. All right, there's still a guy. No, he's gone. These might be the last two. Yes! Ooh, that's nice. Oh, that's satisfying. And that little, that zip. That zip at the end of the mission, too, still... God, I still love that. Yeah. And then the ambience. Embrace your own mortality. For we know not when you will expire. I have played Nuclear Throne, Game Species. Quite a bit of it, actually. I mean to get back and try it out again. I know there's quite a bit to it. That I have not yet explored. Hmm. Hotline Miami movie. That I would probably watch. What the fuck? Looks like the boss solely lost it. No point going in there now, is there? You guys, I think we better get out of here. Ooh, boy! That got loud! Whoa! Let's go, buddy. He got blown in fucking half. Oh, we got, oh my god, timer. Holy shit. It might as well be a maze. Oh, gee, oh god, no. Find your way. Holy shit. This is really loud, I'm sorry. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Go, 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 go! Ooh, man, I don't want to distract from the... from the tension in the air. I think we're out. Oh, man. My name is Ben Smith. My car's broken down on me. I need... Uh... You know, repeat that over. My name is... Fuck it! Look, we need a case back here. It's 19.42 north, 155.28 west. Step on it, he's bleeding out. Hang in there, buddy. He'll be here real soon. He's reaching out. His last dying gasp. 
No need to thank me, kid. It's on the house. You're doing the same for me, right? Oh, I'm anticipating chicken, man. I think I hear the chopper coming now. Maybe you should take this so you don't forget who saved your ass. Throw him the dog tags. Mm. Mr. Black Guy got blown the fuck up, he did. That was sad. That's some heavy shit right there. We got through it, though. With a horrible, horrible level score. Cass Evac. Oh! I got you. Okay. Hot oh, diggity damn. These are my rifles. These are my guns. Sorry to hear about that. Things like that are never easy. Oh, he's in the convenience store now. Well, yeah. You know what they say, time heals all wounds. Right. So you remember that we talked about, the photo we talked about, from Hawaii. Did you ever get around to send me a copy of it? Right, well, whenever you get a chance, man. Look, there seems to be something going on outside my shop. I'm gonna go have a look, okay? Alright, talk to you later. Hmm. Oh, this is, um... This looks like Hotline Miami 1 territory. Intermission? Whoa. That guy, yeah, so the, um... The dude we see in the army scenes, you know, the squad leader, the guy with the red hair, he's the convenience store clerk from Hotline Miami 1. Or the guy that gives you the pizzas or whatever it is. Hello, heaven speaking! Hi, this is... You spoke to my mother. She told me to call you, said you wanted to talk. It's about the mask maniac, right? Right, I didn't think you'd call, to be honest. Well, if you've got time, I'd love to hear your story. I've got time, all right, but it'll cost you. You see, I need a plane ticket. I know it's a lot to ask for. I'm sure it'll be worth your while. Ellipsis. Do we have a deal? Well, I can't promise you anything, but if your story is half as good as you say, then I'll see what I can do, okay? Fair enough. So where do you want me to begin? Take it from the start. I want to get the full picture. All right. Well, it all started with these strange messages on my phone. At first, they were pretty straight, asking me to do things. Small things. Like calling random numbers, leaving cryptic messages. Going around town, painting these marks at certain points. Marks? Yeah, a circle with three lines across. Anyway, I didn't do what they told me to. Figured it was all a prank. After a while, the messages just started getting threatening. A few days passed, and one morning I woke up to find my car torched. And... There was this message on my machine. Saying I better do what I was told. Or bad things would happen. Back to 1989. Back to Miami! You've got one new message. Hi, this is Susan from Miami Funeral Service. We've got an appointment scheduled with you today for the funeral of a Rosa Berg. Come whenever you like. We're open all day. Our office is on Northeast 139th Street. Click. So guys start doing a little bit of a tongue click, right? He is really invested. You think there's a bit more of a difficulty spike here 40 days, huh? ready. Oh, hello. Is this the Russian guy? This looks like the Russian guy. Good morning, Mom. 
Good morning, sweetheart. <laughs> What's wrong? You look upset. Oh, it's nothing. Do you sleep okay? Should I make you some breakfast? I'm not hungry, dear. You know, I had the strangest dream. You were sitting on an island with your father. You were both real quiet, staring out into the sea. It was all so peaceful, but there was something in the air. Something bad that was about to happen. Oh, he's not the Russian guy. He just looks like the Russian guy. Okay, something bad? I don't know. I can't remember what happened. Maybe it wasn't so bad after all. Listen, Mom, I'm heading out for a while, okay? I'll make you dinner when I get back, alright? Alright, dear. I still feel pretty tired. I think I'll take a little nap. Richter. Okay. I don't think I recall. It was a couple of years ago that I played the first one. A little while back. It's head out, though. Oh, we were... Were we downstairs? I guess so. Yep. This is such an interesting... It says the end, right? Oh, it's just a bus stop, though. Ooh. Take it easy, Rap Rack. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Oh, shit. Okay. This one's called First Blood. So we gotta take out the dude with the gun and then get completely destroyed afterward. Oh, God. Wow. How in the world? How in the world? My goodness. Dude. So we gotta pick up one of these real fast. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, that works. <laughs> oh, my God. Dude, this one's fun. That one is fun. Okay, I get it now. That was, uh... A little bit of a- oh god, I don't really want the shotgun though. Yeah, that's the one we definitely don't want to pick up at first. Ooh, we gotta take him out though. Okay, so he's gonna pick up the gun first. Damn it! Ah! It's weird that he takes longer to get up because he was knocked down by the door. Oh god, we can't- okay, can't pick up the shotgun. That's- that's the big one. That's the big issue. Man, ugh. Oh, Jesus, that gets intense. Yes, there we go, Rug the Funk, perfect timing, buddy. Welcome to the Bear Pile, Rug the Funk. Thank you so much for the subscription. Raise up the bear hugs, enjoy the emotes, enjoy the badge, enjoy the knowledge that you, my friend, are making the world a better place. One little bear hug at a time. Nice TV explosion. That'll do the trick. Okay. We're gonna lure this guy, perhaps? Oh, well, you know what? We can just throw some bats at them. Or pick up a gun. That works, too. No longer limited in our options as much. Still exploding. Okay, good. Nice. Okay. Damn, dude. Whew. I don't know where he's starting, man. No kidding, Clifford. Strong punches from this man. Okay, gotta lure this guy, if possible. Or we can just do this. And yeah, there we go. Yikes! Woo! Wow! Okay. This is doing the job. Now, these guys... Probably lure them out. Let's see. Oh, he's coming. He's coming for some hot action. Some Hotline Miami action. Oh yeah, oh, don't you let him go. We are brutal. We are brutal in our dealings, but sometimes those dealings go, don't go as planned. <laughs> that was bad. That was bad. Oh, come on now. I like this approach. This is working. Oh, snap. He's got a good angle on us. He's just waiting for it. Just waiting for us to slip up. Okay, so we're gonna take this. We're gonna head or look down this hallway. Take these two out, probably. Oh god, yeah, that's a bad lock on. Okay. That does not do what we need it to do. Mm-hmm. 
having fun there, bud. You got the damn bathroom all bloody. This whole house painted a new shade of red, my friend. Alright, I'm still okay with this. We gotta take out the range guy for sure, though. Shit. Alright. That'll do. That'll do. Not what I planned, but I'll take it. Oh, that's just a double barrel. We're gonna take this one. Hmm. Whoa, Jesus. Okay. 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 Sure. <laughs> Why not? Fuck it. If they want to line up, we'll mow them down. Mm-hmm. All right. That's the whole level. Good shit. We got it. That wasn't so bad. I'm still not really checking as much around the areas to make sure I'm not missing out on any secrets or anything, but... Well, we'll have another attempt at it. I'm kind of tempted... to, like, maybe even try to speedrun this game. If I feel like that would be... a good time. Dylan the Mance, how's it going, buddy? Welcome, welcome. Which city has the most murders per capita? The U.S. has the most incarcerated citizens per capita, I know that. Oh, Mom, what are you doing down here? I was hungry, so I decided to have a snack. I can take care of myself, you know. You don't have to worry about me so much. You know the doctor told you not to move around too much. I don't care what the doctor said. I'm not dead yet. I've still got some fight left in me. Oh, poor thing. Johnny Trout, nice. Oh, not nice. Oh, but still nice. Okay. <laughs> A mix of emotions within that message, but thank you for being here, man. Hope you get feeling better. Probably, uh, well, I don't actually know how much longer the game has, Oximeter, so we're going to be going until we uh, finish it off. I think I just skipped a line of dialogue there. Oh, is it something urgent? <laughs> I was hoping you would give me a bath. I'm feeling a bit cold. Sorry, Mom. I'll help you with the bath as soon as I get home, okay? I see. Well, where are you going, then? Is another job interview? I'm sure you'll get it this time. Don't get your hopes up, Mom. Finding work ain't easy. You're such a bright young man. They're sure missing out. Don't worry. You'll find something eventually. She's such a sweetheart. Yeah, well, I better go. I'll be back as soon as I can, okay? You run along now, dear. You don't want to be late. Don't worry about me. I can take care of myself. You've got one new message. Hello, this is Andrew from Package Express Shipping. You have some goods to deliver at Northeast 144th Street at 8 p.m. The shipment may be fragile, so make sure to handle the packages carefully. Huh? Don't be late and don't forget to wear your uniform. Click. Although I do always imagine that they just say click once they're done. You feel a little sorry for him, right, Ode? I kinda do too. He's just got a... a sweet disposition about him. Hmm. Seven or eight more sections? Okay. Right on. Right on, I'm ready for that. Well, in light of that... We are near the top of the hour here, guys, so we're going to take our first break of the evening. Those of you watching live, those of you watching VOD, whatever it may be. An un unintentional rhyme, but I like it. We'll be back in just a few. Thank you very much for sticking around. More Hotline Miami 2 coming up. Pew.